Welcome to Visual Learners, where complex topics become clear with vivid imagery and simple explanations. Today, we're diving into the groundbreaking worlds of AlphaFold 3, the AI that's revolutionizing our understanding of life's building blocks. Let's unfold the story of AlphaFold 3, released by Google DeepMind. Demis, thank you very much for your time. AlphaFold 3, big, big upgrade, of course, to the AlphaFold program, which was so significant in terms of the protein folding question for mm -hmm. biologists and for the medical world. AlphaFold 3, so it's able then to predict the structures of all sorts of different biomolecules, including DNA and RNA, and how they interact with each other. Talk to us about the potential significant implications, what you see as the most significant implications of this technology. Yeah, we're very excited about this new AlphaFold version. Um, of course, biology is, as we know, is a dynamic system. Really, all the emergent properties of biology and life are due to interactions between different molecules and different structures. So that's what AlphaFold 3 is about, is a first step in that direction, understanding this dynamic picture um, and understanding what proteins interact with and how they interact with uh, those other types of molecules. So not just other proteins, but also DNA and RNA, like you said. And for the medical world, and in terms of drug discovery, how significant do you think this could be in the months and years ahead? Well, of course, the holy grail for drug discovery is not just knowing the protein structure, mm -hmm. which is what AlphaFold2 did, but actually designing drug compounds called ligands that bind to the protein surface. And you want to know where it binds and how strongly it binds in order for you to design the, the right kind of drug compound. So AlphaFold3 is a, a big step in that direction of um, predicting protein ligand binding and how that interaction will work. Give but before we jump into Alpha Fold, let's rewind a bit. The building blocks of life, literally, are proteins. These complex 3D molecules are the workhorses of our cells, responsible for everything from building tissues to fighting off disease. The problem? Figuring out a protein's 3D structure, crucial for understanding its function, used to be incredibly time-consuming and expensive. Unravel a protein, and you'll see it's like a string of beads, made up of 20 different types of amino acids. Interactions between these amino acids make the protein fold, as it finds its shape out of almost limitless possibilities. For decades, a community of scientists have been working on a way to figure out a protein shape just from its string of amino acids. This is a major challenge in our understanding of biology. That's where AlphaFold comes in. Back in 2020, DeepMind unveiled AlphaFold. This AI tool was a game changer, predicting protein structures with mind-blowing accuracy. AlphaFold 1 and 2 became invaluable tools for biologists worldwide. But DeepMind didn't stop there. They knew proteins don't work alone. Enter AlphaFold 3, released just this week. This new version takes things a giant leap forward. AlphaFold 3 can predict the structure and interactions of not just proteins, but a whole zoo of biological molecules. Groundbreaking paper published in the prestigious journal Nature, Google and DeepMind researchers introduced AlphaFold 3, a revolutionary AI model that can predict the structure and interactions of all life's molecules with unprecedented accuracy. For the interactions between proteins and other types of molecules, AlphaFold 3 demonstrates at least a 50% improvement compared to existing prediction methods. For some critical categories of interaction, it has even doubled prediction accuracy. The researchers hope AlphaFold 3 will transform our understanding of the biological world and accelerate drug discovery. Scientists can now freely access the majority of its capabilities through the newly launched AlphaFold server, an easy-to-use research tool. To unlock AlphaFold 3's potential for drug design, the biotech company Isomorphic Labs is already collaborating with pharmaceutical firms to apply it to real-world drug design challenges, ultimately aiming to develop groundbreaking new treatments for patients. This new model builds upon the foundations laid by its predecessor, AlphaFold2, which made a fundamental breakthrough in protein structure prediction back in 2020. Since then, millions of researchers worldwide have leveraged AlphaFold2 to make important discoveries across fields like malaria vaccines, cancer treatments, and enzyme design. AlphaFold has been cited over 20,000 times already, with its scientific impact recognized through numerous prestigious prizes. Most recently, the Breakthrough Prize in Life Sciences. 
AlphaFold 3 expands beyond just proteins to encompass a vast spectrum of biomolecules. This leap could unlock even more transformative research from developing bio-renewable materials and resilient crops to accelerating drug design and genomics. So how exactly does this new model reveal the secrets of life's molecular machinery? Given an input list of molecules, it generates their joint 3D structure, revealing how they precisely fit together. AlphaFold 3 can model large biomolecules like proteins, DNA, and RNA, as well as smaller molecules known as ligands, a category encompassing many drugs. Furthermore, it can model the chemical modifications to these molecules that control healthy cell function and contribute to disease when disrupted. At its core, the new model features an improved version of the EvoFormer module, a deep learning architecture that drove AlphaFold 2's breakthrough performance. After processing the molecular inputs, AlphaFold 3 assembles its predictions using a diffusion network similar to those used in AI image generators. This diffusion process starts with a cloud of atoms and converges over many steps to its final highest accuracy structure. The researchers state that the model's predictions of molecular interactions surpass the accuracy of all existing computational systems. As a unified model computing entire molecular complexes holistically, it possesses a unique ability to unify scientific insights across disciplines. In the realm of drug discovery, it unlocks new capabilities by accurately predicting interactions of drug-like molecules, such as ligands and antibodies that bind to proteins, influencing their roles in health and disease. The model achieves unprecedented accuracy in predicting these drug-relevant interactions, like ligand binding to proteins and antibodies binding their target proteins. On a key industry benchmark called PoseBusters, AlphaFold 3 demonstrates over 50% higher accuracy than traditional modeling methods, without requiring any input of structural data. This makes it the first AI system to surpass physics-based tools for biomolecular structure prediction. Predicting antibody protein binding with such fidelity is critical for understanding immune response and designing new antibody therapeutics, an emerging drug class. Protein folding is one of these holy grail type problems in biology. We've always hypothesized that AI should be helpful to make these kinds of big scientific breakthroughs more quickly. And then I'll probably be looking at little tunings that might make a difference. It should be creating histogram one and a background histogram. We've been working on our system AlphaFold really hard now for over two years. Rather than having to do painstaking experiments, in the future biologists might be able to instead rely on AI methods to directly predict structures quickly and efficiently. Generally speaking, Biologists tend to be quite skeptical of computational work, and I think that skepticism is healthy and I respect it, but I feel very excited about what AlphaFold can achieve. CASP is when we, we say, look, DeepMind is doing protein folding, this is how good we are, and maybe it's better than everybody else, maybe it isn't. We decided to enter CASP competition because it represented the Olympics of protein folding. CASP, we started to try and speed up the solution to the protein folding problem. When we started CASP in 1994, I certainly was naive about how hard this was going to be. It was very cumbersome to do that because it took a, a long time. Let's see, what, what were we doing still to approve? Typically a hundred different groups from around the world participate in CASP and we take a set of a hundred proteins and we ask the groups to send us what they think the structures look like. We can reach 57.9 GDT on CASP 12 ground truth. CASP has a metric on which you will be scored, which is this GDT metric. On a scale of zero to a hundred, you would expect a GDT over 90 to be a solution to the problem. If we do achieve this, this has incredible medical relevance. The implications are immense from how diseases progress, how you can discover new drugs. It's endless. I wanted to make a, a really simple system and the results have been surprisingly good. The team got some results with a new technique. Not only is it more accurate, but it's much faster than the old system. I think we'll uh, substantially exceed what we're doing right now. But then it's a game, game changer, I think. In CASP 13, something very significant had happened. For the first time, we saw the effective application of artificial intelligence. We've advanced the state of the art in the field, so that's fantastic, but we've still got a long way to go before we've solved it. 
The shapes were now approximately correct for many of the proteins, but the details exactly where each atom sits, which is really what one would call a solution, were not yet there. It doesn't help if you have the tallest ladder when you're going to the moon.